Actually? Yeah. They're like following us with their headlights off. Pentagrams and stuff. Oh my god. They're stopping. Did I start the car? Yep, yeah, 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 they're gonna. Did you guys hear that? Did you hit our car? Yo, what the fuck? Katana! Katana! The fucking light is swinging again. I just jumped up to grab that thing and I heard a knock. No problem, look. Fucking! I literally just got done doing the intro to the like the Missouri video, yeah, and I went to fucking move my slippers to like the corner over there, and I turned around and I s fucking saw the lights swing. really understand what I just said. I'm doing a Missouri video. It is currently dark in here just because, well, we haven't turned any lights on. But I was just doing an intro to a Missouri video that I am making. But last night, we got done hanging out with Ada and Easton and Brooklyn and James. And so we come back to our place. I was doing something over here at the table and this is just kind of like camera gear and whatnot I got some fucking ravioli my kit whatever I was over here and I had moved over here and Katana was in bed and she was like yo this is swinging and I was like what the fuck because I was over there I'm 100% positive I didn't hit it or anything like that and so we did a Spearback session. Initially, we had brought the ghost stuff because I wanted to see if there are any cool, like, Honda locations in Missouri, which there are, unfortunately, in Branson. We're just not near any. But anyway, so we did a spearback session and we had gotten some stuff, but it wasn't nothing too crazy, but we did get some response. This is where, to me, it gets a little bit, like, weird so to speak, right? Like I said, this was all happening on the 25th. So yesterday, the day before, the 24th, right? I have a dream where I woke up in my dream and I saw two shadow figures standing at the foot of the bed. But I wasn't scared because I knew that the shadow people were me and Katana somehow. But at the same time as me viewing those shadow people, I was having a out of body experience and I was looking at everything happen from the ceiling. And so then I took that into account yesterday and I was like, a form of a spirit is now showing up in my dream before anything paranormal happens here. Now, I have talked to Spike for those of you who remember her and she knows a lot more about the paranormal than me and Katana do. She's kind of like the expert that we go to. But she had said that it sounds like we're like we, as in me and Katana, are haunted. Now, I don't know how true that is. She had said it really just depends on each person and what they're experiencing and where they're experiencing it. Now, we're staying at a resort, but we're also staying at a resort in Missouri where I know there was a high, I mean high level of like Indians and like just it has that kind of history so could we be on the grounds like so to speak of like where an Indian tribe was like killed or could we be on a like a burial bear burial ground 
or whatever the case may be because during the spirit box session the reason i say maybe we're on like a burial ground or whatever is i i think i heard the word cadaver which those of you who don't know it means dead body basically it's like the technical term for it so i don't know that's just kind of been what's happening here let me know down in the comments section below if you guys think we're haunted or if it is truly the place that we go to because we we have a lot of I don't, I don't want to say little things because that's not the right word. Like, we have a lot of just things in general happen to us when we're in, like, the most random of places. Like, we're staying at a resort. The fucking chandelier, or the light, whatever you want to call it, is moving now twice. Um, when we had actually first checked into this place, that light was flickering. Like, it was having a seizure. Like, holy fuck, we had to actually turn it off. Um, cause it was just so like, calm down. Um, on this trip, we were at a museum looking at Indian stuff and one of the lights was flickering right as we entered the room. So it's like, is it us or is it this area? I just got fucking chills. Holy shit. Give it a second. So you said it should be a warning. A warning of what? Give me... Three for death. One for um. evil. What was that? Did you hear that? It was a weird touch. Not. No. It was like a like. It's a trinket kind of thing. No, that was like a whisper. It was like, shh, shh. Yeah, it's hurt. It's hurt. It's hurt. 